What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Wes and I'm back at it again with another video. Y'all, I hope y'all been sticking to y'all goals for 2023. You feel me? Hope y'all ain't fall off. You feel me? Not at all. Not yet, at least. But before we get into the video, I want to let you guys know that I've created various playlists on my actual YouTube because I'm not really in a, a niche per se, you feel me? I drop reaction videos, social commentary videos on different type of topics, and I also drop fashion related content. So I've went ahead and created various playlists so that you guys can like check around. You know, I'm making different content for pretty much everybody. You feel me? This is like a one stop shop. Let me know down below what type of videos you would like to see as well. I'm open to suggestions. Also, feel free to hit me up in my email, you know, for anything in regards to videos and things like that. Without further ado, let's just jump into this video. All right. All right. What's up, Nicole? Um, I'm at the Starbucks that you uh, sent me to. You Are you inside or are you in one of these cars? I'm inside. I got a table. Okay, but I'm about to come in right now. I'm going to let you know that we are already filming, so is that cool with you? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Happy New Year and welcome back to another episode on Jack TV. Today's video is crazy, so let's get straight to the point. Nicole has been with her boyfriend for seven years. She wanted to put her boyfriend Malik to the loyalty test, and when I asked her why, this is what she said. I just feel it like when my soul is cheating. So women have this thing called women intuition. And regardless of the fact that Nicole had no hard evidence that proves Malik has been disloyal in any way, shape, or form, she was still willing to trust her women intuition and still go through with the test. And that was all fine with me. How you doing? Jack, nice to meet you. Nicole still lives with her mom, and Malik's living in his own apartment. Now, I know what you guys are thinking. That is a very unorthodox way of living with someone that you've been with for seven years. But when I asked Nicole why don't they live together, this is what she said. I stay with my mom. Okay, what did he say? Uh, he has a spot by himself. Can I ask why? So you guys, I don't know if Nicole felt uncomfortable expressing everything to me because it was our first time meeting or if it was the fact that the cameras was in her face and sometimes the cameras can have that effect on people. But she kind of felt a little bit uneasy and a little bit awkward. So I went ahead and I ended that conversation right there and I got all the information that I needed to know. Whatever information I didn't give her that night, I just reached out to her through text messages where she felt a little bit more comfortable and opened enough. It was nice meeting you, Nicole. I'm going to keep you updated. Uh, I got your number and your Instagram or whatever. And, uh, Okay. So Nicole ended up sending me the address to where Malik stayed, and she also sent me the type of car he drove. She visited me and basically told me all she wanted me to do was follow him around. And you guys know I do not like doing these type of videos because they are very time consuming. So most of this video where I follow him around, I am not going to put in the video because it's not going to do anything but bore you guys to death, and I know you guys want to get straight to the action. Big facts, let's get into it. So yeah, it's 12 14 right now. We're basically sitting outside of his apartment. As we talk about the exit, so we know exactly when Malik comes out or whatever. So we just basically waiting to see when he's gonna come out, whenever that is. This video could have easily been hours on top of hours on top of hours on top of hours. So I'm gonna just cut all that out right now and let you guys know exactly what happened. So I pulled up to Malik Apartments. He sat in his apartments for hours. Then he finally came out of his apartment and he decided to go get something to eat. Look, 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 look. Who goes inside at McDonald's? <laughs> That's what they do. Yeah. Girl, he's going back home. Oh my God. I sit somewhere. I need new scenery, bro. I sit somewhere. I don't want to sit there no more, bro. So now we was having to sit outside his house for more and more hours. Then he left his house and he went to this unknown house, which we are at now, and that's when I decided to call Nicole. Hello. Hello, Nicole. So uh, we followed him from his house. All he did so far was go to McDonald's. Then he went back home for a few more hours. And now he's at this house. If you FaceTime me, I can show you what house he at. But it's a, he's at a house. I want to see if you know what house this is. Okay, cool. All right, so uh, when you leave from here and go to the next location, I'll just keep updating you. Okay. Okay. So now we're about to wait for him to put a whole Christmas tree up. <laughs> and we wait. Bro. <laughs> God. The whole situation to me does seem a little sus. I ain't going to hold you, though. Let me know what you think down below. Hey. So we literally sat outside his house for hours to literally watch him go get something to eat just to go back to his house and sit for more hours just to go put up a Christmas tree for her mom 
which we have to sit there for more hours. And at that point, next thing you know, you look up, it's dark outside. Bro, I'm about to just tell her it. <laughs> Yo, this is crazy. <sighs> I'm about to just tell her we're going to call it a night, bro. He's still there. Like, what kind of Christmas tree is he putting up? So you want to, should I just call it? He ain't putting up no Christmas tree. Hello, Nicole? My bad to bother you while you're at work. We've been sitting here for a while. We hungry and stuff. So I was thinking about calling it a night. He, he's still at your mom's house. He have not left. So I don't know what you want me to do. Um, do you want to pick back up tomorrow? Uh, wait, wait, wait. He's still where? He's still at your mom's house. Wait. Wait, I don't understand. What you need? he's still at my mom's house? We're sitting outside your mom's house. He haven't left yet. All right. Um, Work. I'm about to head that way. Okay. What the fuck you doing there, bro? I don't know. He had that bomb in the school or something. We haven't eaten anything all day. Me and my team was ready to tap out. Now Nicole had us waiting there longer for her to come actually join us. Nighttime. Do y'all believe that he's still putting up a Christmas tree? You feel me? Because me, I already said this probably uh, 30 seconds ago. He ain't putting up no Christmas tree. This is just, this don't even make any sense. It's mad late. Freezing. Man, we've been waiting outside for some time, and I ain't never put a Christmas tree up before, so you guys comment down in the comments, how long did it take for you to actually put your Christmas tree up? Because I've never did it before. <laughs> Not that long. You got a light so yes, sir, yeah. We can hear him in the right neighborhood. We don't know who he is. He's pulling up on us like that. I called on the way over here. He didn't pick up. All right. Just call him and see, like, if he gonna answer. He could be in his sleep. If he don't answer, just call your mom. Hey. That's it. Um... Where are you at? I've been trying to call you and this is the first time I've been able to get in touch with you. My phone be dead all day. I've been at the home with the home button, watching the game shit. Um, at work. It's, it's going um, pretty stressful, but you know, I'm thugging it out like always. What happened? I said, um, just dealing with these claims and shit. Um, you still with your homeboys right now? Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, we just chilling, ain't doing nothing. Okay, well, I just want to tell you that I miss you. I love you. That's it. I miss you too. I love you too. I knew this fool was lying. I'll be on like Crazy. Yeah. He literally just lied and told us that he'd been with his friends all day not knowing that me and my team been following him the whole entire day. Then I told Nicole to ask him where he was and he lied and said that he was at his partner's house currently, but we was outside. But if you're at her mom's house putting up her Christmas tree, why lie about that? Oh, shit. He said he would be home later. He lied. Cause y'all been sitting here all fucking day and said that he ain't up. Bruh, what are you doing in there? Who are you gonna ask? Uh, my mama. Why do you have to do that to my mama? Yo, why are they having this delay reaction right now, bro? <laughs> like, bro. Think, let your mind wander, bro. Exactly what it is that you're thinking is exactly what's going on, man. And it's wild. Just let it, just let it wander, man. It's fucked up, but it's happening. He in there is smashing her moms, which is crazy. Unless he has some fishy shit. We gotta go inside. You gotta go her mom's house with these cats, is it? I don't give a what happens right now. I, I just don't want to put my camera. No, I don't put no, I don't want to put nobody at risk. No, 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 no. This is my thing because I asked y'all to follow him and y'all said that he been here for the past four going on five hours 
I done left work and he just told me that he was chilling with his homeboy. That's a fucking problem for me. Let's finish this out. Y'all here now? Let's finish right. this out. Jack, what you want to do? You know what? Yeah, at least call him. It, it's not point. We might as well just go outside. We here. Right, I'm going to get the other camera drip and we can just... So for those of you who are still watching, I know I'm not the only one who put two and two together in my head. I did not want to tell Nicole nothing in the car because it's still a possibility that I could have been wrong. Because we are short-handed today on staff, I had to go in and I had to grab a camera myself. And we went ahead and proceeded to Nicole's house. Now, I told her to be quiet because if they were in there doing something they had no business, we did not want to alert them that we were coming. We kind of just wanted to catch them in the act. <sighs> They try to be quiet, so they don't know you. Nah. Crazy to see it. I already knew that this was what was going on. But it's just wow. Like, you really got people, mothers, fucking their boyfriends. <laughs> like, yo, what kind of crazy shit is this? Shaking my head. You know when somebody get caught doing something that they're not supposed to be doing, they deflect. Not only that, they look like this man right here. Look at him. Like, bro, why are you so concerned? Leave Jack TV link down below. But I've seen a few of his videos. And some people come on their show after they get caught. And they always be like, yo, wh what is he doing here? What is he doing here? Like, what you mean what he's doing here? It's exactly what you see. Let's continue into the video. Whoa, slow down. The mother said, the mother said that you don't even do anything for him. That, does that sound like a mother in her right mind? I mean, we already know that she's not in her right mind based upon what she did. You feel me? By fucking her daughter's boyfriend. We already know something. The screw is kind of loose. But the fact that she's even saying that lets me know like this woman is actually really crazy. And she don't got no shame. She don't got no guilt. And she don't got no conscience. Why would he Why would he even say that and say, yo, the mother treats you, be treat you better? I don't need to see the mom's face or anything like that. Cool, whatever case may be. But the way that the mother shaped, she shaped like a damn beanbag. <laughs> like my guy what is what is this man this is wow Calm down. You gotta go. Go. You 
free. No fucking free. What? Free. free. There. We what? Got free. We got tired. Yeah. We got tired. Let's hey, go. What the I've been following free. you for days. Listen, I'm letting y'all guys know what's going on. I've been following you for days, man. We, we was outside the whole house. Okay, let's go. Get you worried about the wrong motherfucking thing. You get up here in the bed with my mama like it's our home and shit. Looking for me, bro? Let's go. Get out of my house. Wait, 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 wait. It's time to go. Bruh, 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 that fool out Jack, he doing way too much. What's wrong with this guy? Malik started to do a little bit too much. He was pushing me around. He started putting his hands on her. So I kind of just felt like I had to intervene for a little while. It didn't get too out of hand. Drip was there to stop everything. So nothing really went too far, you guys. And we ended up just taking everything outside. Matter of fact, you can have your shit. Your shit will be on the porch. Bye. Good luck. Bye. 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 Bye.
Are you, you gonna sue the shit out of you? Cause I still, he still got a camera pointing in my face. Like, what do you mean? You are on my property. It's where I lay my head, where I pay my bills. You don't do nothing for me. So why are you invading but my property? You don't pay the phone bill. Now, y'all got it, I got it, bro. Listen, okay. I understand your frustration. Please. I understand this all the situation around the holidays, holidays is very care. unfortunate, ma'am. All I need is my phone and I'll be out of your hair. What, what, are, you, what are you really doing here? It's not just I'm about here to get my phone. I'm here to get my here? phone. I'm glad I brought the Why cameras so, so they can see that you're not giving me my property. So what? It's mine. You left it in my house. It's mine now. Mine now. Call them up because I'm going to call them too because y'all still on my property. You see this? My, 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 mine. Nothing on here belongs to you. Well, so can you just call Nicole, let her know I'm here to get my phone. I have no way of contacting her. That's what I'm saying. Yes, you do. I don't even... How did you get in contact with her last time to come over to my house? Yo, she's slow. Like, you have his phone. How is... She's slow. I'm here. I'm here to just get my property. I'm just here to get my property, ma'am. That's all I'm here to do. Ma'am, that's not your property. It is. You came into my house. That's my name on this house. That's mine. So when you step in... Everything in there belongs to me. Bro, so therefore, waste your time. She got her daughter still packed up. You feel me? After what she did, word. Moving her daughter out. You wasting your time talking to her, bro. Clearly, bro. Just call the police and try to Come get on. it back like Let's that. Let's listen to him, cause at least somebody's smart in this situation. Let's go. Bye bye. You have a good day. She's evil, bro. She is. Well, now she's taunting me, bro. She's taunting, bro. You too nice. You too nice, bro. Nah, Word, way too nice. Better than me, though. <laughs> she, she's clearly not there all the way, bro. How do you how do you do that to your daughter and then put her stuff on you all? Come on, bro. So, you guys, I don't know how, what I'm going to do now to go about getting my phone back, but I guess this is probably the end of this video. I'm going to try to keep y'all posted on what happens after this or whatever. But, yeah, I'm getting my phone back. Where you need to get that. Until next time, Jack off. So that's the end of that video. Let me know what you guys think down below. You know, this woman, this mother, whatever the hell you want to call this fucked up lady, um, she ain't shit at all. She really not shit at all. And hopefully Jack get his phone back. But I'm glad that the daughter found out about all of this before, you know, anything else. You feel me? At the end of the day, this show be saving lives, man. It really be saving lives. So anyway, let me know what you guys think down below. Stay tuned. Be blessed. And I'll be back with another one. All right. Peace.